Hey everybody, I'm Steven21967 and we're in Valheim. So, I've made the artisan table, but when I made the artisan table, I did not get the recipes for the spinning wheel or for the windmill. And from what I understand about the game and its progression, procedural based progression, my understanding is that before you can get moved on from one area to another you need to like achieve a certain task and when i look at the spinning wheel which i don't have available it's not in my menu it's not anywhere here it's something i can craft it's not under miscellaneous and it's not in here anywhere none of these are spinning wheel or the uh the windmill when I'm looking at the list of the things that I have done, I have uh, discovered that looking at the recipe for a spinning wheel, I see it says uh, 20 fine wood. Okay, I've, I've chopped down trees to get fine wood. And then 10 iron nails. So I have not made iron nails. And I have a feeling that the iron nails might be tripping it up. Well, let me check here. I want to do... A real quick check for the windmill too because I think it also needs iron nails I think that once I make iron nails I should probably get the the recipe I should finally so-called find the recipe or get the achievement for the recipe so we've got iron nails and I'm hoping that when I click this we will see spam that we got the windmill and the spinning wheel because right now I have the artisan table so I have the minimum requirement I I have flax I actually have flax so it can't be flax that I'm missing the windmill um, converts barley into barley flour and I have I have barley I do have it let's go over here and let's see did I put you in here or are you down here? Let me check in to see if I can find it. Yeah. We have barley. We have flax. I have everything. I have everything I need to start making uh, barley flour. And I think it's linen, right? We're using flax to create linen thread. So let's go ahead and make an iron nail. Cross our fingers and see if we suddenly get the... Uh, Get the ability to craft the spinning wheel and uh, the windmill. Cross my fingers. There it is. Windmill and spinning wheel. So, <laughs> and Raven Throne. Okay. We have to make that too. Yeah, as, as I go, I don't always, um, like I didn't see iron nails as anything I needed to build anything. So I never, ever made it. So we need uh, 10 iron nails for a spinning wheel. So we got 10. And then it says we need 30 for the windmill. Okay, let's go one, two, three. All right, so for any of you that might have been having problems with getting, uh, I think I put it over here. Yeah, let's put it over here. With getting the windmill. That's windmill and the spinning wheel. After you get the others in stable. I think it's because you didn't do one of these things. Which is um, getting iron nails. Now let's get a little sleep to the morning. Let's put these together. And let's throw these items inside. Alright. So windmill needs 20 stone and, and 30 wood. So 20 stone, 30 wood. Okay. Oh. Um, hey. Hi. Okay, come here. Oh, you hurt me. Bam. And bam. And bam. There used to be a time when I dreaded the brute. <laughs> how many of you remember the brute and how bad he was? How difficult he was? Yeah, somehow 
they're spawning within my base, so I don't know quite what it is that's causing it. Maybe I need to put up uh, some more workbenches. Maybe that'll stop them from spawning. So we need 20 stone. And we got 30 wood, so let's go get some stones. I have a bunch of stones over here. All right, uh, do I have some food? Yeah, let's just do that. Let's just get some regular food going. Uh, okay, we got enough. So the windmill, I'm assuming we're going to put out here. So there it is. And as you see, I have a lot of room because the artisan table gives us an absolute ton of room that we can put this up. So I, I don't know. I don't know where I want to put it. Yeah, just put it right here. You kind of have everything over here. And let's see. So this is the out. That looks like an in. That looks like an in. That looks like an in. There we go. So let's put that right there. And it's a nice windy day. Okay, that's windmill. That's the process. And all right, windmill. This must be where we put it. So we're putting in flax, right? Yeah, we're putting in flax. We can get 22 flax. All right, 29 flax. Wow, that's, that's kind of noisy. It's kind of noisy. I don't think it matters which way it, it, it's pointed because I don't have any idea of which way the wind is blowing. Maybe it's blowing, the rain is coming this, it's going that direction. So maybe the wind is coming from there. So I don't know if it really matters. And let me, let me check. This, I don't think this needs any fuel because it's the wind. The wind is what gives us the fuel. So we got windmill done. Let's go for the spinning wheel next. All right, we need fine wood times 20, iron nails times 10, and leather scrap. I have leather, leather scrap. And we only needed, what? We needed five, so we don't grab the whole thing. Don't grab the whole thing. Just grab what you need right now. And we don't need any stone. So let's get rid of that. Close that door. I don't want these brutes walking into my base and surprising me. It's definitely not something I want to have happen. I might not have fine wood. We might... <laughs> I got two. I got two fine wood. Okay, so um, I'm going to run out into the game and get a whole bunch you know i could i could take you along with me i could i could still take you along with me couldn't i oh saving the game <laughs> yeah come along man let's go do this together let's go eat some of this stuff let's go get our max stats and um let's see where we can find we don't need a lot of fine wood i just need to find a few birch trees and that should do it. Alright, come on birch trees, where are you? You're making my video go long. You're making everybody wait. Alright, birch tree. Um, I thought I equipped this. Okay. I thought I equipped my axe, but apparently not. Twenty fine wood. Oh, where are you going? Okay, it said three, four. Okay, we got ten. Um, where's some more? There's a birch tree right there. Ooh, knock down some more trees. I don't mind. But we just I just want the fine wood right now. Oh, 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 watch it, watch it. Twenty-one. Okay guys, we got twenty-one. Twenty-one is enough. Let's get back to the base. Let's go build the spinning wheel. We'll put that inside. We'll put that inside the base. We don't have to stand out in the rain. I'll put it probably put it right over where where the artisan's table is situated. And I need I need to do some building with my base to expand it. 
And I also think I need to throw down a whole bunch of... Look at that windmill go, man. Go, windmill, go! There you go. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do about building another uh, bridge. Maybe, maybe not. All right, that's still going. Okay. I guess I can just grab it. Yeah, that's how we do it. All right, inside, everyone. Let's get inside. Nice and nice and warm in here, so to speak. We don't have we don't have fire nearby. So let's get this spinning wheel done. Okay, where are we going to put you? I don't know. Yeah, you just kind of slip it in the corner. How's that look? There we go. It's in the shelter. Uh. Uh, I think it might be backwards. All right, that's a great thing about this game, man. Something's wrong. You can just destroy it and put it back together. Uh, I'm going to put it down. Where do we want to put it? We want to put it... Okay, so... That's the in and that's the out. I think. I think I'm getting it here. Um, let's... Yeah, we're going to try putting it up here and see what happens. If this ends up with stuff going all over the place, then yeah, we got to find a better spot for this. Okay. We go adding flax. Okay, and then it comes. I mean, the way this looks, it looks like it's just gonna fall out. You know, the same way it does for the blast furnace and and the smelter. So the question will be, if it falls out here, will it will it end up maybe falling out here and kind of stuff, where it gets to be a mess? And then what we gotta do is we gotta we gotta expand this because. Yeah, I know. We gotta do some building because we kind of got everything bunched up here. I don't have very much done. Like, this is my bedroom. I need to do more for my bedroom to get this. You know, get the rested bonus up a little bit higher. You know, get all that stuff taken care of. Alright, let's do a quick look. Okay, there you go. Linen thread, padded curris. Alright, that stuff goes by so fast. Black metal. There it is, porcupine, porcupine, and I'm going to grab you two, let's go down here and take a look at porcupine, do a little repair, okay, padded curus needs iron, okay, armor 26, so those are greaves, Right? Try okay, I have to figure this, you know, this whole thing out. Is this something we add? I'm a, I'm gonna have to oh yeah. Expertly crafted leg protection. So is this something we add on top of our equipment? Alright. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to look, I don't know enough about how this stuff works. So, let's go down here. There's a black metal axe. Okay, emerald shield. Sheen, I definitely want to make one of these. I have enough black metal to actually do that right now. There's a black metal... Ager? At... Adager? At... Etger? Ager? I don't know how to pronounce it. Let me go back up here. Scroll back down. We got that. Alright, bronze padded helmet so I guess this is actually armor itself yeah this kind of looks like it's going to replace whatever we have and then we just max it out so that's what all that padded stuff is it's new armor black metal knife um, I'm assuming that's for sneaking and I don't sneak and there it is porcupine so I think I have enough iron left over. Fine wood, we can go farm a little bit more. I'm pretty sure I have five needles and we're gonna get linen thread really soon. And of course I have that, I already got that stuff, so. And a black metal sword, I just said sword, almost said sword. 
un until now when I'm saying that I almost said sword. Sword? That's looking really good, man. We gotta do a comparison of these weapons to see what's really best, you know. But the porcupine. This is max level Frostner. That blunt is bigger. The frost. There's no frost. There's just a pierce. There's no spirit. Uh, block power. Okay, that's parry force. Yeah, parry bonus times two. Knockback is only 90. Backstab 30. Okay. I do wonder if it is going to be better than the Frostner or the Black or Black Sword. Black Metal. Black Metal Sword. Yeah. We're going to have to make a little bit of everything. So anyway, we got this figured out. So for any of you people who are having trouble, I hope, you know, I hope that this kind of helps you out. Let's go over here and let's grab all of our flour. Oh, there it is. That's kind of cool. All right. Grab it. Oh, look at all those new recipes. That was it. <laughs> that was it. I. Th that's kind of the bummer thing is these. We get all these new recipes and it's like, okay, now I gotta figure out where the heck did all those recipes we just get go. So I'm gonna double check here. Nothing ended up here. Okay. And I don't think they're gonna end up there. Cauldron. There we go. We can make some bread. 40, 70. Okay, that's good. Blood pudding. I have lots of blood. Barley flour. We have barley flour like that right there. 90 health, 50 stam, 2400. Four ticks. Wow. And now we can make this. Look at that. Oh my lord, this is all great. Let me look at the fire. Where's the fire resistance? I okay, there's fire resistance. Plus some of the some of the shaman in the falling shamans or goblin shamans if you want to call them that goblin shamans uh throw fire and i hate i hate it because then i'm on fire if it hits me and now we don't have to worry about this anymore actually serpents do 80 of 80 locks is 80 of 80 you know what getting locks finding locks to kill is easy easy killing locks is hard Finding serpents to kill is hard. So this is going to become our new food. We're going to get that. We're going to make some blood pudding. And the bread actually looks pretty good. But let's see. Yeah, it's kind of... Do we do cooked lox meat or do I just do bread? That's a bit. Okay, so we got everything done in this video, guys. Everything's done. Everything's caught up. We're going to work on getting some black metal kind of made. Let's take a look at this. There's 10 left to be done. And over here, we got more flour. Flour. It's flour. And, oh, we're, we're, all, we're all done. That's it. Okay, that's it for our barley flour. Now we got to go back to the falling villages and start raiding them. But I have to do that anyway because, you guys, I, I still don't know where, what is it, Yagalath? I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. I feel so embarrassed because this is supposed to be Viking lore, lore and I'm, I'm just about 100% Norwegian, and I don't even know some some of these pronunciations. I feel I feel ashamed of myself. Go ahead and comments tell me how ashamed you are that I don't know how to pronounce these things. Uh yeah, um, yeah. We gotta get back to the villages. We gotta hit them up. We've gotta get ourselves some more stuff. And that'll just be it for this video. So, guys, I hope that if you were stuck on the windmill and the spinning wheel, that we helped you to figure out how to get those things to pop up so you can actually make them. Because I couldn't make them even after I made the artisan table. And it's because this game is procedural based. The game, I'm sure, is assuming that you have done the made the effort to create iron nails to build something. And that's, that's all that's happened. What's that noise? Better not be attacking my ship. I gotta do something to seal this up. I've seen plenty of videos of how to seal up ships so they're protected from attacks. And how to enclose my bay, my the water so they can't get out to my boats. I may do that too soon. 
All right, so that'll be it for this video. I think there's just some animals that were fighting, and that's where I was hearing that noise. I mean, it could be wrong. So anyway, guys, that'll be it for this video. If you like this video, I would appreciate a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the notification bell to get alerts when I come out with new videos. And as always, comment. Tell me, did I help you out? I, I would really like to know that I helped uh, anybody who got stuck. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, that's too bright. Later, dudes.